urgently turn Chelsea OLHA what kind of money are you? Why do you think this is here? But before, I entered the channel because here was all the videos like the latest news from Chelsea and so I don't lose the monthly notices, I do not have to get the sense of notifications. Chelsea send £50 million transfer order to La Liga amid interest from Tottenham and Aston Villa. Chelsea will not sell Conor Gallagher for less than £50 million, leaving the midfielder without a year to spare current contract, I informed London World. Atletico Madrid, now Spanish in La Liga, is the last club to show interest in the mid-English season, while London World Cup winners in Spain say they are ready to beat Chelsea, with the Blues insisting on their victory over the player must be proud. Chelsea made it clear that they are willing to sell Gallagher, who is part of a group of players who represent pure money, but is not diminishing his expectations. Gallagher has been in charge for much of the past season under the command of Mauricio Pochettino. The 24-year-old Campester is now furious with the English selection in the Euro and admits that he will not lose sight of the deals about his future, rather than focusing on helping his country. Gallagher said, the Chelsea player is not right now and he's thinking about England and not the tournament. It's not difficult. He's from England and I can't be happier with the position he is in. But I'm going to concentrate on England. Nessa Paws News, just to think that YouTube keeps recommended AS latest Chelsea news for you, it's very important that you just like this video. Value. Keep with the news. Tottenham have a Gallagher's long-term admiration, but we still know they correspond to his offer. Aston Villa have also been linked recently. Chelsea are trying to balance their accounts, with around £1 billion being spent on us two years since Bluco took over. Club. Last season, Gallagher scored seven goals and two new assists in 50 games at Chelsea and was never named when teammates were more eager to meet physical or mentally ill players. Fonts told London World that, considering all of them according to speculation, Gallagher is happy to see him and the club will not accept a new agreement or sale before the transfer window closes. Expect Chelsea to adopt a football-based approach under the command of new technician Enzo Maresca, who will replace Pochettino next summer. Gallagher has been trying for over two years to adapt, tending to compete under the command of coaches such as Thomas Tuchel, Frank Lampard and Pochettino. Aston Villa have reached an agreement to sign Chelsea defender Ian Matson ahead of Borussia Dortmund, according to Fabrizio Romano. The left-back spent the second half of the campaign with Dortmund where he was hugely impressive en route to the Champions League final. Dortmund were hoping to negotiate on his £35 million release clause, but the Blues have now finalised an agreement with the Villains instead. The Midlands outfit will pay £37.5 million over multiple installations and an agreement could be formally announced in the coming days. Meanwhile, the Blues are also expected to buy a player from the Villains, who need to balance their books with outgoings by June 30. Jan Duran looked the outright choice at the start of the month, but a deal appears unlikely at the moment due to his wage demands. The Colombian ace has refused to lower his salary requirements and the Blues are likely to look at other candidates up for sale at Villa. Chelsea, as always, are our cup winners like the most moving club in the Premier League. With the nomination of Enzo Maresca for Stamford Bridge, some important names are becoming increasingly polemical. Michael Aulis is not just a priority for Chelsea, but also for other English clubs. Liverpool turned to Crystal Palace's young star as a long-term substitute for M.O. Sulla. No, it is possible that the sub-21 Frenchman is clearly behind Chelsea. Although Alice has been sacked, the management and Italian technician also want to keep Noni Meduc, who is currently at Chelsea's first academy under the command of Argentine technician Mauricio Pochettino. The English player from Nigerian ascendancy has a strong influence on our wings. They were fundamental during the 23-24 season climax, which resulted in Chelsea finishing in sixth place. The child has always been familiar with English circus situations since childhood. He trained at Crystal Palace Academy and was also captain of the sub-16 team at Tottenham Hotspur. Noni Maduk is linked with her Stamford Bridge debut, but in agreement with recent reports, the manager said she will remain at the club. 
the new engineer has set a gigantic goal to rebuild the time from zero. Enzo Maresca leaves Campeonato de Liga football and claims to be a strong reform. According to Pep Guardiola, his characteristics are very high and he is a pragmatic footballer. It is about introducing two extremely strong ones, like Alice and Maduk. Alice and Maduk tried to play in rotation towards the sides. The Blues have already hired Tosin Adarabio for free because the plant reform process is underway. Many reports have been made about the saying by key Chelsea players, including some of Maduk's most recent reports from The Athletic Illuminated. If Alice becomes less enthusiastic, they consider themselves to be the only one who surpasses the mantra of two players for every position, which the majority of club leaders agree on. Expect Cole Palmer to play with greater regularity in the number 10 position. Maduk has had previous experience at PSV and has also played 35 Premier League games during his spell at Chelsea. If used with Sabadoria, it can be a good combination with Alice. The new Premier League fixture for the upcoming 24-25 season looks difficult for Chelsea on the opening weekend. With the appointment of a new manager at Stamford Bridge and a very average previous season, Chelsea saw themselves finish sixth, Blues are constantly making headlines, be it with transfers, appointments, or the departure of a key member of management. Amidst all this pernophilia, Nicholas Jackson, a key striker for the team, has expressed his desire to leave Chelsea. Along with this, the Blues have also inquired about signing a new 17-year-old Brazilian winger. Maresca has been quite busy in the transfer market, signing defenders for free and also running errands for high-profile wingers. Along with this, he is looking for key backups in young prodigies as a long-term investment. Esteveo Willian is one prominent name that has popped up recently. A lot of Brazilian talent might be seen in PL soon. Chelsea met the City's end first on August 3 in a friendly match. That can be a warm-up match for a mammoth one that is scheduled for August 18th, in the first week of the Premier League. The Blues are making a tour of the USA, and Jackson is supposedly to be performing in them. The Senegalese striker has been entrusted with goal-scoring responsibilities ahead of Romelu Lukaku, and he is very well delivering the same. Nicholas Jackson in his days has been a key member of the team. A quick and veritable young player, Jackson has not left anyone feeling the absence of Tammy Abraham. In his debut season, the striker has scored 14 Premier League goals in 35 appearances, and he also boasts La Liga experience. Considering Jackson showcases his brilliance in the preseason, a lot of clubs have lined up for him. Some serious interests are coming from Spain, and the striker can return to his habitual environment. As a matter of fact, Jackson has expressed his desire to leave due to the departure of Mauricio Pochettino. Nicholas Jackson admired the former Chelsea manager deeply and was comfortable under him, who gave him the big break. While Chelsea is constantly looking for a new striker, Atletico Madrid is keen on signing the young starlet back to La Liga. Chelsea has also shown interest in another 17-year-old winger from Brazil, Esteveo Willian. This can be a long-term investment by Italian manager Enzo Maresca. Willian has already made 11 appearances for Palmeiras, scoring one goal in the league. The South American has been given the nickname, The Little Messi, by a few Brazilian news outlets. There is speculation that the teenager is coming to the Stamford Bridge for a staggering £51 million. And the turnover agora of Chelsea I want to know you. What is your opinion on this? Please note our comments, do not know, but your opinion is very important for Chelsea to say I'm sorry as soon as a news from Chelsea.